Hi, my name is Peter Maria da Silva, and I'm the staff product designer working on the dual workflow project. And today I'm going to share with you a brief walkthrough of a user experience prototype. So it does not contain any working code, but it helps us demonstrate what we're thinking for dual workflow and its capabilities. So the scenario here is fixing a failing pipeline. And in this uh, walkthrough, you're going to see how we can iterate with Duo on the problem, how we can select from multiple different approaches to solve the same problem, and also how Duo helps us understand better the problem space, how we can solve it, and even provide some mentoring at the end. So as we can see here at the bottom, uh, we have the pipeline failing uh, in this test integration. Let's select it and select the option to troubleshoot the pipeline with Duo. So it's now going to analyze the pipeline and explain it in a brief um, way. We also have some follow-ups here and the ability to fix this test. So let's do that. And now Duo is creating the workflow for us and generating a couple of plans uh, with different ways that we could so solve this. So we also have a few prompts here to explain the plan in simple language and also to compare plan options in case we want to understand a little bit better what is the main difference between this straightforward plan or the more comprehensive plan. For now, we're going to stay with the straightforward plan. But in any case, when we're looking at the plan, we can always ask questions about what's uh, in here. So for this particular task, I want to understand a little bit better what it contains. So I'm going to ask Dua to explain it for me. All right. We see here we have an explanation of what the task involves and a few follow-up questions if we want to learn more. And let's review the plan. All looks good. Uh, we have some suggested tasks here. I'm going to accept, commit, and push changes. And also, yes, we want to run a successful pipeline in the end to validate that everything is working. And now to execute the plan, we can either execute it continuously so it does not pause, or interactively, it was going to pause at each task. For the purposes of this walkthrough, it's mostly going to do continuously, and we'll only pause at selected moments that we picked for uh, this demo for you. So we select execution. We can see here in this mini workflow view what is the status of the current task and what it's doing. And this allows us to navigate into other places of the ID without always having this file open. All right, it's fixing the problem. We can see that Duo already opened a few files for us and made some changes, as we can see here in the Git extension. All right, it's almost there. And it now paused at this particular task to demonstrate a few capabilities. So one is uh, the mini workflow view that we can expand and collapse at any time to see what's going on. Uh, we can also at any time select this button to open the log or this one. And it is going to show you exactly what's happening under the hood. What are the commands? What are the outputs of Duo's um, you know, actions? And we can also edit the plan or even request changes in plain language. So I'm actually going to request that Duo uh, make some changes and extracts the token validation logic. So let's update the plan. It updated the plan and let's click continue. So it's doing what I asked it to do and it's complete. So it did those changes and here's a summary of what it did. Let's continue to document the issue and solution. It's in progress and now pauses at this particular task for our input. In this case, what is the commit message that we want? It already generated a great commit message, so we're going to accept it as it is, but we can always change it if we want. Let's select continue. It's now committing the changes. There you go. And it's running a successful pipeline. So the pipeline is running. Let's wait for pass. And the workflow is complete. We can see it's complete here at the top. And the results are that it ran a passing pipeline. It committed and pushed two changed files. And now we have this what's next section for recommendations and learning resources based on this workflow so that we can actually have some follow-up items for us to act on and avoid things like this in the future. Um, and what we've seen just now is the ability for Duo to help us on a workflow with a specific goal in mind across many different tasks from start to finish with different options for plans, different approaches to the same problem, the ability to explain and mentor the user, and always the ability for users to step in, pause, iterate, and ask for Duo to do things a little bit differently. 
thank you so much for your time. I hope uh, you enjoyed it.